Welcome back to HouseboatGraphics.com. This is another one of our tutorial videos on how to install your decals on a smooth surface. You're going to need a few things to get started with this, uh, including masking tape, scissors, a tape measure, the squeegee that we've provided you with, and some 70% isopropyl alcohol. So first you want to prepare your surface. Uh, make sure to clean uh, a few feet beyond where you think your decal is going to end just to be on the safe side using that 70% isopropyl alcohol. Next we're going to get a couple of pieces of tape ready, about six inches each, and just have them within reaching distance. Uh, this is going to be installed dry. Uh, we don't use soap uh, solution to position our decals. Uh, if this is your first installation, it's probably a good idea to have a friend help you out. Uh, once you've done it once or twice, though, you can you can pull it off yourself. So using those couple of pieces of tape that we had, we're going to tack up our decal, uh, roughly where we want it to be. Once that's on there well, we're going to measure uh, all around it, make sure that we have it exactly how we want it to be. I measure it from a window or a door. Just make sure it's straight. If you need to move it a little bit, you can just lift up one side of the tape uh, and then tack it back down. So once you have it where you want it, uh, we're going to take a couple pieces of masking tape and run them roughly up the middle of the decal. You don't have to be exact. And this is going to create a center hinge for us to uh, make this install nice and easy. So now we're going to remove the tape from the right side and we're going to remove the backer from the decal. Just start at one edge and peel it back a little bit. Make sure you have your scissors nearby or your friend has them. and we're going to pull the decal back right upon itself and this is going to make sure that the decal uh, separates from the, the backer and not from the transfer tape. So we're going to pull it all the way back to the hinge and we're going to trim off that backing paper. And now we're going to start squeegeeing it on there. So with your uh, right hand, hold the decal nice and taut, a few inches away from the surface that you're installing on. And with your other hand, you're going to start squeegeeing it on uh, in overlapping strokes uh, from the inside towards the outside. Be firm while you're doing this. Uh, overlap each one of the strokes, just like you're mowing the lawn, until you get to the edge and then you can just start working out towards the edge. Now we're going to remove those two pieces of tape from the center. Move the tape from the left and pull the decal back uh, over itself. And we're going to peel back the backing paper about halfway and do the same thing in the opposite direction. Overlapping pattern from the inside towards the outside. Now that it's all on there, it's probably a good idea to go over the entire decal with your squeegee, uh, just to make sure that all the edges are down, press real firmly, go over the whole thing, just to be safe. Next go back and remove the transfer tape. And you want to pull that back upon itself, just like you did earlier. Sometimes it wants to tear, but uh, try and keep it as a single piece, it makes it a lot easier. We're almost done, you just want to look over the decal real close and make sure that you don't have any big bubbles or wrinkles. Uh, for any bubbles, just pop them at the edge with, the, uh, with an X-Acto knife and work the air out. 
Uh, if you've got any wrinkles, heat them up with a, uh, with a heat gun or a blow dryer and uh, reposition them. So that concludes this tutorial. Uh, if you have a boat with, uh, with textured surfaces, check out our next one.